It's now time to introduce our first dream timer. After taking hundreds of letters over the past couple of weeks, it's time to make some of your requests reality. Our first dream timer wanted to be part of this area's pennant fever in a special way. He's a 27-year-old Jersey resident who wanted to be in the booth to describe all the Phillies' excitement. The dream scene is set, and here he comes. Tad Kazneski, dressed in short sleeves, a tie, and a big smile. He met me at Veteran Stadium. His dream? To become a member of the press and do play-by-play -play for a Phillies game. No runs, one hit, no errors, one man left on base. We move to the home half of the fourth. Reds lead it four to nothing. When he walked into the broadcast booth, Tad appeared a little overwhelmed. He's done play-by-play -play before, but on the high school level. So he came prepared with plenty of notes and other material. But as he soon found out, the view in the major leagues is a whole new ball game. This would be Tad's star-spangled night. Kevin Stocker at shortstop, Dave Hollins at third. After the intros, time to play ball. 3-2 pitch, in for a base hit in the left center field. Dykstra does a good job, bobbles it, it gets by him. Brumfield gonna go into third base standing. It'll be a single and a two base error against the center fielder, Lenny Dykstra. The biggest hit of the night for Tad happened just before the third inning when veteran Phil's broadcaster, Harry Callis, joined him for a short time in the booth. How you doing, Harry? Nice to meet you. He's got us behind, what's going on? That must be bad luck. Reggie Sanders, the right fielder of the plate. Reggie tested Terry's pitching broken hand his first time up when he grounded sharply right up the middle. Mahalan on a nice play. What of unusual for Pregosi to bring the infield in this early in the game. We're in the third inning. Phil's trail 2-0, but um, he's doing it here on Reggie Sanders. It was a, just a blast just to sit here for that one inning with you know, my idol, if you will, in broadcasting. It was really neat. He had a couple nice asides to me, gave me some tips. It was a lot of fun. And Harry the K, as he's so-called, seemed to have fun working with Tad the K. Tad's got a future in this business. <laughs> I hope so. It'd be nice. Sound good. Yeah. Thank you. And thank you, Tad, for writing in. Got to thank the Phillies for helping to set that up. And, of course, Harry Callis. He really had a good time up there. That's and, uh, neat. He's pretty he did good. A really Make good his dream come true. Yeah, he's, he's pretty good. Great, he you know? really did. Stay in the booth. Don't, like I said, don't take my job. <laughs> I need this. Okay, you think. So next on the news.